Wow, this is a good story. Check this out, man. Remember this guy? Ah, Ted Cruz. Lion Ted. There he is, Lion Ted. He's got his finger finger up. Remember? <laughs> Fucking Trump said he's got one hand one hand on the Bible and the other hand he's lying. Right. Lion Ted. All right, so what's Lion Ted saying today? Lion Ted. Ted Cruz introduced a term limit bill. Wow, term limits. That would end his career in Senate. That's uh, been so. Uh, I'm reading from businessinsider.com. I believe in term limits, I think it's a good thing. I want to play two videos. We got Ted Cruz in his own words describing what he wants to do, and then we're going to hear from Bernie Sanders. Oh, shit, Bernie Sanders. You remember in, in the what was it back in 95, 1995? He was saying the exact opposite, right? So Sanders doesn't agree with term limits, and, and Ted Cruz is petitioning for it. So I'm going to read this article and then I'll I'll play uh, the two clips. It's about two and a half minutes total, and then you can, then I'll come back and make make up you make up your own mind. Ted Cruz introduced a constitutional amendment. Wow, that's big. That's heavy. That would allow only two terms for senators and three three for members of the House of Representatives. It would limit blah, blah, blah. Congress terms are unlimited at the time at, at this time. Though there are limits on individual committees. Right, so here we go. Republican Senator Ted Cruz introduced a constitutional amendment on Friday that would restrict senators to two six-year terms. If it's passed, it would limit Cruz's senator, Senate career to its current term because Cruz has been in there for 18 years. The amendment would also limit members of House of Representatives to, two, to three two-year terms. So six years for the House and 12 years for Senate. It's co-sponsored by Marco Rubio, uh, Mike Lee, and David Perdue, Senators. Although there are limits to the number of terms members of Congress may have on committees, Cruz has been a longtime critic of the Constitution, not including term limits. So he's changing his tune. Did I read that right? Cruz has been a longtime critic of the Constitution, not including term limits. Yeah. He introduced a similar bill a year ago, according to ABC News. For too long, members of Congress, quote, for too long, members of Congress have abused their power and ignored the will of the American people. Term limits on members of Congress offer a solution to the brokenness we see in D.C. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so let's, let's, fuck it. Let's watch it in their own terms. So, so you're gonna hear Ted Cruz go full throat. I think this is a little older. This is from like 2017 when he first introduced it. I don't know what's behind it, but let's let's listen l listen to it and then I'll come back. You look across this country, people are fed up with Washington. This election was the American people saying enough already with the corruption in Washington. And it's both parties. It's Democrats and Republicans who have been here too long, who become captured by this city. And, and if you look at President Trump campaigned on draining the swamp, on term limits, you look at congressional leaders, we got majorities in both houses, I think we ought to demonstrate that we heard the voters, bring up term limits, pass it, send it to the states for ratification. And what's amazing is the support for this, it cuts across in this polarized time. You get super majorities of Republicans, of Democrats, of independents who all say, throw the bums out. And we ought to listen. Mr. Speaker, the American people are angry and frustrated about the Congress and its lack of responsiveness to their needs. The rich get richer, the poor get poorer, and the middle class continues to shrink. Congress doesn't act. The people are angry. The standard of living of the average American worker continues to go down, 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 and we continue to lose huge numbers of decent paying jobs to desperate third world countries. Congress doesn't act. The people are angry. The United States today is the only major industrialized nation on earth without a national health care system. The Congress doesn't act. The people are angry. And what are term limits? going to do about any of this, nothing except perhaps make a bad situation worse. Mr. Speaker, the problem with American politics is not that we can't force out every member of Congress every six years. That's not the problem. 
The problem is that the United States Congress today is dominated by big money interests and that this institution works primarily for the wealthy and the powerful and not the ordinary American. That's the problem and all of the term limits in the world are not going to change that reality. Mr. Speaker, if we are going to make the Congress responsive to ordinary Americans, we need campaign finance reform, not term limits. We need to stop millionaires from buying their own seats and end the absurdity of 20% of the members of Congress being millionaires themselves. We need to stop corporations from putting huge amounts of campaign contributions into political parties as soft money. We need to stop powerful interests like the insurance companies from buying the airwaves to prevent ha real health care reform. Mr. Speaker, let us pass campaign finance reform, not term limits, and return power back to ordinary Americans. Thank wow, you. so you got Ted Cruz saying throw the bums out, right? After, okay, so I, well, here's my take on it. Term, I, I believe in both, right? Throw the bums out, right? Term limits. But what Bernie Sanders is saying is it's the, it's the campaign finance laws, right? So Bernie's making the argument that, that if you take, even if you limit the terms, the corruption remains. True or false? Yeah, it's, it's true. Right? So I, I, I tend to not believe that if you, if you just give, if you just set term limits, that nothing will come of that. Uh, that's where I, I would differ with Sanders. I think that I think that Cruz is right about uh, limiting the bums, get rid of them, because there's too many people in there. They're fossils, right? They've been in there forever, right? Two years, I say two, two, two-year terms for both. Congress is a two-year run. You get you get two of those. Senate is six years. Make it two, two, two-year terms. Time to go. Campaign finance laws, absolutely. Get the money out of politics. So it's a. Uh, I, I think this is a twofer. I believe. Um, I believe Cruz one hundred percent on this one. I believe Sanders fifty percent because he's not willing to go the full one hundred percent and 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 make the term limits, right? Term limits. Marcus Conti reporting.